Well, hello, everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Shaolin Wars Adventure. <laughs> that dang phone! <laughs> In Car Mechanics Simulator 2015. So, I heard that there's like a. There's a so oh cool, so it's a path test. You need 2500 XP to upgrade garage with path test. Okay, that's interesting. Oh! Check this out once in a while. You will get points for each 1,000 XP earned. Then you can spend on upgrades. Each upgrade will make it work easier and quicker. Oh, this is so cool. Right on. It's the OBD scanner. Cool. Uh, what else can we... Yeah, shut up. That's it. Um, there's a parking garage, supposedly, somewhere. Oh, it's this. Same toolbox, okay. Uh, what's this? Ah, ah, here you go, 9,000 XP. Okay, so that's cool, that's cool. So let's get on to this stuff. So, with this car, what's... Oh, um, okay, belt tensioner, timing belt, and water pump. Okay, so... This is like the last car, right? So we need to, right here, there's the belt tensioner. So let's actually disassemble that. Um, the water pump, hey? So let's actually do examine mode and let's examine all this stuff. Okay, 83%. Ooh, that's a yellow, 77%. Uh, we'll have to examine that by disassembling it. So let's take this one off. Let's take this one off. And we can take this one off. Okay, unscrew. Bang. Okay, uh, what else do we need to do in this car? Timing belt and water pump. Okay, that's easy. Where's the water pump? Um, okay, well this is fine. This is we need to take. We have to take this thing off. We're gonna have to take this thing off as well. So that's the roller. And then we'll have to take this thing off. So this is where the timing belt is located. Uh, and this game, I don't know, with the music and just, it's relaxing. Uh, timing belt, let's actually examine the timing belt here. It's probably confirmed to be crappy. Okay, so that's the timing belt. Now if we hit O, there's a water pump somewhere. Where is that water pump? Oh, you know what? I have the water pump. Duh. Okay. So let's get out of this. Let's go over here. So we have our parts that we got to deal with. Um, actually, inventory. So I'm going to need a timing belt. I'm going to need a new water pump. And a belt tensioner. Because this one's pretty low too, actually. So water pump, belt, tensioner, let's see, so we'll just do this, water pump, uh, yes, and we want a belt, tensioner, that one, okay, perfect, okay, and what else do we need, we're going to need, uh, let's see here, we need um, timing belts, I think. Do we need a timing belt? Let's take a quick peek here. Yeah, we need a timing belt. And... Yeah, a timing belt. These are okay, so okay. Timing belts. Perfect, get out of that. Let's go back to this car here. See, we can only do one car at a time. There's no point in having multiple cars. Alright, okay, normal mode. Let's go back to here. And we can go to assemble mode. Let's put in a timing belt. Obviously the good one. And we can put the cover back on. That one. Screw this stuff back in. I might have to grind the X XP a bit, so I might actually just show the other car and then maybe 
I don't know, maybe, ah, whatever. We'll have you come along the trip. <laughs> What's the point, right? You know, some people watch this stuff. You know, you might, you might not. You know, I appreciate if you do watch all my videos because you know, I do try and create this kind of content. Well, any kind of content, really. This is how I play games now, all right? It's through YouTube. And so, yeah. I don't know if I can refurbish any of these parts yet. Maybe I can when I upgrade. Uh, what's the next piece? The next piece is, I think, the belt. Put that one back in place. And then we put this one back in place. And I think this completes this one. If I go, oh, belt tensioner. Okay. Oh, right here, right here. Aha. This one, belt tensioner. Okay, and I think this is now complete. We can finish that job. Bye bye. Let's go to this car right here. We do have the phone. Um, yeah, no, let's just do it one at a time. So, what's wrong with this car? R rubber brushing, sprint cap, sway bar. Fix. You find to fix any rem running gear problems. Okay, and. What does that say? Um, you repair with parts exceeding. The minimum condition 71%. Okay. So I don't see any time limits here. But uh, let's actually close the hood. I want to actually. I guess we can't use the path test. We don't have 2500 XP. So we'll just have to. We'll move this vehicle over to the left uh, lift. Let's go grab another car. Engine powers for the fix. Loud on accelerating. Uh, let's take this job here. It's an engine job. Engine power has failed. Let's take that job. Okay, perfect. So we took that job. It's another car. We'll throw this one into the right lifter. And should we take one more car for for shits and giggles? We don't want this one. We don't. We're not. We're unable to fix any running gear problems. Gear problems. What is? Uh, filters need replacing. We'll take this one. That'll be easy. Okay. Perfect. Um, find and fix any running gear problems. I want to try that one, but that's okay. So this is a filter change, and we got the other two cars there. So maybe let's take a quick peek in this air, fuel, and oil filter. So let's order that. Uh, filter so we need the air filter fuel filter and oil filter there's a lot of other filters too uh, more phone calls the engine's working but it's choppy it's cool I like this how it's vague okay let's do this one this one's easy so I'm thinking filters are in the engine. Um, well, here we go. So we'll have this. Let's go to examine mode. Air filter cover. It's just seventy percent, hey? Oh, but we don't have to worry about. Okay, repair with parts exceeding minimum condition of sixty-six percent. Okay, so air filter. Uh, where else? Where else would we find other filters? I don't know. We'll have to check that out. Okay, so let's go disassemble mode. I'm using the keyboard here, the one, two, three, the controls in the top left hand corner, which is kind of convenient. Uh, um, what? Ah, ha, ha. look at that, folks. See so right here? These clips. <laughs> let's disassemble these clips. Oh, that's hilarious. They're actually items. Uh, are there any more clips? Uh, on the back side here. That's hilarious. They're too funny. This game gets detailed sometimes. Okay, let's. Now I can take the air cover off. Let us examine the full. Oh, that's definitely bad. <laughs> Uh, we can t we'll take the, the air filter out. Okay. 
where would other filters be now? Probably down in here somewhere. There's the oil filter down under here. So let's actually go examine mode. There's fuel filter there. Oil. Okay, I see them now. So if we examine this thing, what's this thing set to? 72%. That's acceptable. So let's put in an air filter. Brand new one. Okay, then we can we'll zoom out a bit. We can put this back on. We can put the, the, the clips back on. Put that clip back on. That clip. That clip. Okay, that one's done. Now, uh, if we go disassemble mode. Let's left click on this thing because that's how you target. By left clicking on something, will target that that item. So now, if we go examine mode here, uh, assemble accessible from undercar. So this is obviously crappy. We'll take out the fuel filter. Let's put in a new fuel filter. Okay, and I think we want to do this thing uh, accessible from under the car. Ooh, so what do we do if we get too many cars? We'll have to come back to this car, basically. I'll leave the hood up so we know we're working on it. Uh, what's this car? This car is. Front shock absorber, rubber brushing, spring cap, that's a lot. How about this one? Ignition coil. Okay, let's... Where would the ignition coil be? Would it be inside the engine? Hmm. Ignition coil, where would that be? Gearbox, throttle, brake servo. Oh, look, look, you can actually zoom in. Engine head, engine cover. I'm just kind of trying to see engine block. Starter. What did I get myself into, hey? Um, let's just hop out of this for a second. Let's go, oh, again, ignition coil. So I'm assuming that there's ignition coil. Just kind of moving along here. Fuel rail, uh, belt, tensioner. ABS pump, throttle, power steering pump, okay, engine block, brake servo, gearbox. I'm wondering if it's like, it might have to take the engine apart, hey? Let's see here. Oh, wait, starter, is that, let's see, uh, three. Examined by electronic meter. Oh, I don't have anything. So how are we going to complete this? Ignition coil. Well, I guess what we can do is let's start taking it apart, and we'll just see what's what, what happens here. So we can we'll start with ah uh, here we go ignition coils, right here. So if we go examine mode, we can just examine each one of these. Can't be OBD, so. Well, obviously, you just have to trust this thing. So, ignition coil. Okay. Now, inventory. Ignition coil. Yeah, there we go. Ignition coil. Let's see if we can find that. There we go. Ignition coil. Now we got stuff to sell. Um, 
Let's get rid of these old, these crappy parts. We don't need this stuff. Mission coil. Okay, perfect. Zoom in. Go to assemble mode. Assemble that. And that should complete the job. Bang, okay. Then we can put this into the left the left bay here or the right the, the right lifter. Let's close it. Okay, let's close this bad boy and then we can actually lift this car up. So that we can get underneath it here. And where are we I want to do we want to do the oil filter, right? Uh, oil filter, zoom in. Okay, I want to use my mouse to, you know, like right click and hold to get access to this. But yeah, so let's go examine mode. Can be examined by taking off the car. Okay. Okay, and then uh, three. Can be examined by, with the compression tester. So we definitely need to add parts. <laughs> We need to, to upgrade our, our stuff. So we're probably going to have to grind these things. Just doing these things like this. Um, this repair order is now done. Let's get rid of that car. Perfect. Magically gone. Now we got this boy. Okay. Wow. Okay. So I imagine we're going to have to probably lift this beast up. Um front shock a rubber brushing spring cap sway bar yeah let's see what happens let's lift the car up that's so cool okay so steering rack front drive axle ah sway bar I see I see let's go up this way zoom in a bit okay so Examine mode. Can I just? Yeah. So, how do you disassemble these? Um, do I have to take the whole wheel off? Maybe. Oh, that's that'd be interesting. So let's uh, look apart. Let's examine this. Can be exact, but taken off. Okay. Oh, we gotta do all these. <laughs> I can just move the mouse and have the, the mouse button clicked and off it comes. Okay, yeah, I think these are all connected to each other. So this is why mechanics charge so much, right? So let's see here. If I can take the brake calipers off. Like this. Okay, take the brake pads, take this, the brake disc, take the front wheel, hub, um, inner tie rod, do I have to take this one, lower suspension arm, Okay. Can I t take this off? Okay. Now what? Uh, how do I move this up? Uh, oh, I can't. Okay. Um. Uh, here we go. Maybe you didn't have to take apart the whole tire. Okay, we got that one. Uh, what do we need to do? Tire rod, front shock absorber. And test path. So how do we get this guy off? To take the axle off. the hell hey 
front wheel hub. Oh, what's this? Wheel hub bearing. Ah, wheel hub. These are bolts. Okay. Oh, what's this? Oh, oh come on. And your tie rod. Okay, uh, front. why can't I take that? Front spring. Let's see here. Oh. It's, what is it doing? It's jammed now. Ah, the game's bugged. Here we go, hit escape. Uh, zoom out a bit. Oh, there we go, now I can do it. That's so funny. Let's take the spring, take the knuckle. Okay, so that's a holy dismantle. It might have done a little bit too much. <laughs> The inventory. Oh yeah, look at all that stuff. So we need to replace the sway bar front end link A. Everything else looks okay though. So sway bar front end link A. Sway bar front end link A. Yeah, sway bar front end link A. Sway bar. Link A. Okay. We're gonna do. Are we gonna do this one at a time? This one, because I need to re replace this stuff. Um. Yeah. Okay. So now, assemble mode. Ah, okay. Put the silhouette. So let's put the spring in. Um. Seventy-one percent. Okay. Okay. 71%. Oop. Okay, uh, this guy. Okay, perfect. And this one. Looks like inner tie rod. Got the shock absorber cap. Ooh, 71%. Uh, exceeding minimum part. So, it's not exceeding 71%. Okay. Uh, what else now? Yeah, this one. Suspension arm. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. And then this one. We got this one we got put back. Yeah, okay. Made a mess with this whole thing, hey? For the front wheel hub, 71%. Oops. Okay. And reassemble. Oops. Wheel hub bearing. Oh shoot, what was that one? Oh, well, I'll press date. Uh, okay. 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 I didn't see the condition of that. I'm, I'm kind of in a tunnel vision mode right now. Okay. Uh, okay. What else do I have to put in? I have to put this thing. Perfect. Uh, now I can put the tire on. Screw them in. So we can definitely speed these up as well. Okay, and so that part's done. Let's go on to this side actually. We can kind of see it here. So let's actually get into disassemble mode. 
we probably don't need to disassemble everything. Uh, oh, right here. Oh, I see how they're linked together. So if we take the tire off. Okay, perfect. Uh, oh, here we go. Sway bar front end link A. So we need sway bar and the front shock absorber. Okay, so with that in mind, let's do that. Ooh. I think this one again. Let's check our inventory. Uh, why is this like this? Oh, here we go. The scrolling of this is terrible. Um, okay, so front bar and link A, which is what we got here. Right? We replaced the other one, which we didn't have to, probably. And then we have this front shock absorber that we need to buy. Front shock absorber. Front shock absorber. Perfect. Okay, I think that will do that. Let's get into assembly mode. Let's focus on this stuff. We can put this back in. Put the new one in place. Okay, we can put this sway bar back in place. Actually, you know what? Let um, me cancel this. I guess we can't. I should really put in the other part instead. So let's take this out. <laughs> Watch me repeat myself, of course. I might be bad mechanic for that, but that's okay. <laughs> it's part of the simulation. Okay. And then we can put the shock absorber back on it. Okay. And let's see, let's we can focus on this thing. So now we just gotta replace the tire, and I think we're good. The rim. Okay. Now let's take a look at spring cap and rubber brushing. What the heck is that for? Okay, well, let's go into normal mode. Spring cap. And rubber brushing. Okay. Interesting. Um, assemble from engine bay. Accessible from engine bay. Um, I'm just trying to kind of see other parts. Three. Examine mode. Okay. Uh, Rubber brushing. I wonder where that would come from. How do I go up? Uh, like this. I can't go up. I can only go up so high. Oh, what's this? Uh, rubber brushing. Here we go. Cool. So, how do we disassemble this? Cool. We got the rubber brushing. How about this side? If we go inventory, say so we need a new rubber brushing. Good, good, good. I'm glad I found it. A spring cap. What's the spring cap? Front shock absorber. Spring cap. Hmm. Well, anyways, let's buy that new part. Uh, rubber bushing. 
Where's the computer? Here we go. Rubber bushing. <clears throat> this one's taking a bit long, so I apologize for that, but uh, rubber bushing, I think that's what it's called. I don't think there's a rubber bushing, rubber bushing. Okay, perfect, perfect. Let's put that in. Uh, where are we? We need to go over here. Here we go. Let's put that bad boy in. New rubber bushing, okay. Now a spring cap. Spring cap. Uh, let's check the back. Ah, here we go. Uh, I'm not sure if it's this side or this side. Ah, here it's this side. Okay, so how do we take that out? Ah, we take the shock absorber, rear spring, and a spring cap. Okay, that's cool. So now if we go to the spring cap here. And that's it. And then we'll finish the episode with with seeing what kind of jobs that we have. Okay, spring cap. Okay, assemble mode. Get the new spring cap. Gonna put the rear springs in place. And the shock absorber cap. And I think that completes this one. Yeah, that completes everything. Bang! Job's finished. So there you go, folks. So I got 712 experience. I need more experience to upgrade the toolbox and whatnot. So thank you, everybody, for watching. And I look forward. Oh, let's get. I forgot. Wow, well, look at these cool cars. This is the DLC that I have, the Delray Custom. But we don't have enough experience for that. And we don't have enough experience for this one. Fix any running gear problems. The engine is working, but choppy. So let's take this one. Perfect, perfect. This loading stuff is is atrocious. We'll take the oh. We gotta move this guy to the the left lifter. And let's take this job. Okay, perfecto. Okay, we put this in the right one. There we go. And that's it, folks. So thank you, everybody, for watching. Hopefully, you're enjoying the series so far. I'm enjoying making the series. And, yeah, I look forward to seeing you all in the next episode. Can I climb up here? Uh, doesn't look like it. Okay. Perfect. Have a great day, folks.